turn in there? Or a walker? Oh, Clementine. Dead dog? Another dead dog? Holy shit, it's a boat. This was here the whole time? I know, right? It's not a boat from the moon. It'll take us to the moon. Damn, my ears are cheap. How's Omid? Omid's doing okay? As well as can be expected under the circumstances. I did what I could for him. Cleaned out the wound. He's got a real infection, running a fever. Without antibiotics, I... Will you quit pacing? You're making everyone nervous. Why are you even still here? Hey, if your friend really can get that boat working, you're taking me with you as payment for saving your asses. I figure that's fair enough, don't you? Well? <sighs> you want the good news or the bad news? The bad news. Let's get the bad news out of the way first. Bad news is, she's not taking us anywhere the shape she's in right now. Gas tank's empty and the battery's dead. He's pacing because if so he stands still, he slips news? over. That's it. That's all she needs. Some gas and a battery. Other than that, she's good to go. Well, how are we supposed to get that stuff? Um... What about Crawford? Sounds like Crawford is the one place that has everything we need. Maybe we should try there. Now hold on a minute. Surely we have to try? If there are people left in this city who are still alive, who still have supplies, what harm can it do to ask? Trust me, you don't know these people. I do. You showing up with a wounded man? Might as well put a noose around his neck. They don't exactly welcome children with open arms either. What the hell kind of a place are we talking about here? The worst kind? But I don't see what other choice we have. And just how exactly do you figure we do this? Because, from what I've heard, that place ain't exactly friendly to outsiders. We gotta sneak There's in. There's got to be some way we can sneak in there undetected. There might actually be a way. I know the sewer system that runs beneath Crawford like the back of my hand. Y'all wouldn't happen to have a map by any chance. Well, we just happen yeah, to have one. He has a lot of trouble going to the I bathroom. I think I could lead us through so over. we could pass under the perimeter and right into the center where they keep their supplies. We come up right underneath them, take them by surprise, grab what we need, and get out before they even knew what hit them. That's actually not the worst idea I've ever heard. I mean, it's close, but I don't know. Maybe it could work. I've thought about it before, just never had the people to do it. But I think if we all work together, we could pull it off. And what do you want in return for all this help you're giving us? Crawford doesn't just have what you need for your boat. They're also well stocked with medical supplies. Medicine that my people could use, just as yours could. We can do this. We have to. So, we could totally it's do this. decided then? We're going to Crawford? Let's we do it. We can do this. I know it. Hell yeah, we can. Are we seriously talking about this? I mean, what about the risk? I don't know about you, kid, but I'd rather take a chance on doing something than just sitting around here waiting to die. That boat out there is an answered prayer. Just gotta push a little bit farther. Are you in or out? We can't bring this kid with us. He'll fucking get us all killed. We should go tonight, under cover of dark. I'll go let my people know. Give you all a chance to prepare. I'll be back before midnight. Be careful. That's how I'm still alive. A 
told you to stay in your room. How long have you been there? Big lips for sucking nips. Is it going to be dangerous? Is what going to be dangerous? Crawford. Yep. I can't lie to you, Cliff. Yeah, it's going to be dangerous. But it's the only way to get the things we need to make Omi better and get the boat working. That's why we have to do this. Do you understand? I don't want anyone else to die. Neither do I. Neither do I, Clem, but sometimes we have to take that kind of risk. Use Clem as bait. All those pedophiles up I in... should go get ready. Uh, place. Say what now? You said you'd need all of us to do this, and you said I'm a big help, remember? Oh my god, Clement. Molly said Crawford is the only place left in Savannah that still has people. That means it must be where my mom and dad are, right? Mm. I don't think they'll be there. I don't think I'll find them in Crawford, Sweet Pea. Why not? Because they're good people. And Crawford is a bad place run by bad people. I don't think they would have stayed in a place like that. How do you know they're good if you've never met them? Well, they raised well, you. They raised you, didn't they? Can't I come with you? I'm sorry, Clementine. I can't risk you in this. No. I'm sorry. Stay here and be safe, Clementine. It's way too fucking dangerous for her. Check out what I found in the garage. Hatchet, hacksaw, some other tools. Might come in handy on this little break-in. Nice. Can I talk to you a minute? What's up? I took another look at the boat. She's a 30-footer. So? So, we're gonna have a capacity problem. Assuming everyone makes it back alive, there ain't gonna be room for everyone. What are you trying to say? Just giving you a heads up is all. Thought you ought to know. Thank you, Kenny. Who the hell is this? This is Bree. She can help us. Um, the more the merrier. Good. We're gonna need all the help we can get. I was a student at the school where Crawford keeps their supplies. I know the layout. Then what are we waiting for? Let's get moving. I should have taken Clem, huh? I'm leaving her with Ben. It's a bad Ooh, idea. A can I bring her now? Come on, change my mind. You understand why you have to stay behind, don't you? I guess. Plus, you have a job to do. An important job. What are you talking I about? I need you to stay here and watch over the house. Watch over Omi. And watch over Ben. What should I do if something happens while you're gone? Hmm. Here's the gun. Here. I want you to take this. That had no bullets. You know use it, don't you? It's just like I showed you. I remember. So well, if anyone tries there. to get inside the house that isn't one of us... Or if something does happen to Omid. I know what to do. Let's get you inside. Yeah, we're not leaving Clementine to be babysat by Ben. We're leaving Clementine to babysit Ben. Because Ben's useless. We can leave him behind if we can. Oh, Ben's coming with us. Let's Thank get goodness. This over with. <laughs> He's just going to get himself killed. I can see it now. He's so useless. People are like, no, how about I just wait she by is. the sewer? We're right underneath the center of Crawford. And we'll come the back and be The school dead. should be directly above us. Okay, people. This is it. Remember the plan. We stay quiet. We stay hidden. And we stay together. We find what we need, and we get the hell out before anyone even knows we're there. Got it? 
Yeah, Ben's gonna be like, oh guys, I'll just stay at the sewer, and then you guys can uh, can come get me when we're done. <laughs> and then we'll come back and find him dead. I bet. I bet you that's what's gonna happen. Oh god. Let's go. Oh dear. You'd think they'd have guard posts around the place. Guards posted around the place. Where is everybody? There should be guards patrolling. What? Are you disappointed? It's just strange is all. I think I see one. Over there by the door. Oh shit. Okay. Walker. Me and Kenny will sneak up trying to take him out quiet. The rest of you wait for our signal then follow us over. Everybody got it? Okay Kenny, let's do this quiet. No shooting unless there's no other choice. Right behind you. Pyro, I'm going to assume that you're just agreeing with me by saying that Ben's going to kill himself unintentionally. But uh, if that's actually a spoiler, don't spoil shit, please. I don't want no spoilers. Oh my what shit. The fuck? What the fuck is Oh dear. What the fuck is a walker doing inside here? This Get inside! Fucking fast. Overrun. You don't know three shits about this game. Good. What a nice face you have. It would be a shame if anybody were to eat it. Oh, Ben didn't stay behind. He's gonna do some dumb shit, I'm sure. I'll just hide in the locker. Fuck! Fuck! Do you think they saw us? They probably saw us. Definitely. Shit! Ben, calm the what fuck the down. What the hell happened here? I thought this place was supposed to be secure. What always happens, I guess. In the end, the dead always win. Oh man, we are so screwed. No. This is good. Um... What? How the fuck is this good? Before, everyone at Crawford was smart and they had guns. Now they're dumb and they don't. Hey, trying to look on the bright side here. Yes, you're right. I agree. So long as we don't let them box us in, we can still do this. The plan hasn't changed. The plan hasn't changed? Every time walkers show up, the plan changes. Do you even have any idea how many of them are out there? No. You want to do a head count? Or do you want to get what we need and get the hell out of here? Come on. I think I know which way to head. You don't have to run fast. You just have to run faster than Ben. That's the way. I got He's a fucking bad rolling. feeling about this. He's a tall freaking gym, gym guy. Oh dear. Just keep moving. Here. Looks okay. Everybody in. No, they need Cannibal Jenkins. I told you no good would come from city folk and their zombie machines. And their zombie infections. It's Cannonball Jenkins. The armory would be a nice place to go. Figures. Nope. Looks like they were using this room as some kind of command center. Okay, so now what? Where do we start looking? Here. Robert Downey Jr. plays the part of every single zombie and all the main characters. Just give me a sec. 
and there's also Johnny Depp as his amusing sidekick. Fuel? Where can we find some fuel for the boat? There's a maintenance shed across from the playground here. If they were storing fuel, that's probably where it'll be. Medicine? Where would be the best place to look for medicine? Right here. Nurse's station. They were using it as a medical facility. How do you know that? Just makes sense, doesn't it? She was in here, but she escaped. So then we just need a battery. This auto shop. It's right next door. Yep, it's called Herman's. You can't miss it. Okay, I'll make the run to the maintenance shed for the fuel. It'll be faster if I go with you. I can take you right to it. I'll come too. No, two people's enough. You stay here, see if you can use any of those tools we brought to get that armory door open. We might need to shoot our way out of here. I'll go for the medicine. I'll come with you. I know what to take. Okay. Guess that leaves me to go find us a battery. I'll go with you. Watch your back. Okay, we've got a plan. Everyone be careful. Stay close to one another. We'll all meet back here. Good luck. Shit. I don't like this at all, but we have to do it. You know what they say? K Sera Sera. Whatever will be, will be. We don't need books. What's on the shelf? Nothing but crayons and construction paper. Mm hmm. Uh, paste. A world map. We don't need any of this shit. There's a rubbish. Ben, you bastard. Are you holding up here, Ben? Hey, you need any help with that? Thanks, I got it. Just once, I'd like to do something useful, you know? Hmm. You're, You're plenty, plenty useful. useful. Huh. Yeah, right. Seems like all I ever do is get us into trouble. Yeah, you're right. Well, uh... I'll let you get on with it. I was trying to give him a bit of a pep talk, you know, keep his spirits up, but it doesn't seem to be no, working. No, wait. There is something you can help me with. Something that's been on my mind. I could use your opinion. What is it? It's Kenny. Since I've been helping him work on the boat, I've gotten to know him a little better. He's a good guy, you know? And it's eating me up knowing what I know. I've been thinking about telling him the truth. Ben, come on. This again? It's my fault Duck and Katja got killed. Don't tell them. If I hadn't screwed up back at the motor inn, they'd still be alive. How am I supposed to just carry something like that around? I have to tell him. No, man. Ben, no offense, but have you lost your motherfucking mind? Kenny's barely hanging on. You tell him you're to blame? I don't even want to think about what he might He'll do. He'll kill you. I know. I've thought about that. But I don't know how much longer I can keep looking him in the eye. I feel like I'm lying to him by not telling I'm him. I'm telling you, man, it's a bad idea. Real, real bad. Hey, maybe you're okay walking around with somebody's blood on your hands, but that's not who I am. I can't just pretend it never happened. Man, if you tell him you're fucking Look, dead. We need Kenny. We need him to hold his shit together if we're ever gonna get out of here. So you need to keep this to yourself, for the good of everyone. You hear me? Shit, Ben. I hear you. I'm gonna get back to this. You need to calm yourself down. Keep it to yourself until we're, you know, we're boated away to Hawaii or something. And we're having nice martinis and shit. Then you can be like, oh, hey, Kenny, you remember that time that your son died? Yeah, that was my fault. All. And they'll be like, ha, 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 ha. Have another drink and then it'll poison and you, die. you can die. But, you know, till then, keep it to your fucking self, boy. Shell casings. The alleyway to the auto shops down here. You coming or not? I'm taking some shell casing first. Climb shell casings. They've already been fired. They're worthless. Climb the shell casings. What a peculiar action to take. I heard some things to the right, I think to the left. Alright, let's go out here. That's what they need the boat. Yeah, to get to Hawaii. And we need little umbrellas for our drinks. That's the other like supply we're looking for. Alleyway, where the auto shop is. But where the hell is Molly? Oh, RJ. Sorry for spoiling that then. Um, you can go to my YouTube channel and watch.
My I upload the vault. You out here? So. Guess I'm not going that way. Yeah, RJ, I definitely recommend watching chapter three since you missed that. Just go to my YouTube channel down the bottom. It it'll be up like after I do this, I'll upload it from from Twitch. Auto shop must be down this way. Deliveries made in rear. If you catch my drift, I hear a zombie. Holy shit. There's a zombie in here. Where's the zombie? Zombies. Where are they? Oh, let's just climb up here nonchalantly. It's good, it's good. Oh, thank goodness he didn't slip over. Okay, um... Let's open the garage door. Oh man. Damn. It's jammed tight. We need a jack or something to open it. Why did that chick just abandon me out here? Oh man, there's gonna be zombie days. Out here. Oh dear. Better not get too close. Yeah, how about we back the fuck away from that? Um Holy shit. Leave him! Shh. Don't be so He's loud. Mine. Shh, fuck. Shit. What were you doing up there? <coughs> oh, he raped you or something, did he? Molly? <coughs> Molly! Shut it up. What? I think you got it. More. So much noise. He's wearing medical scrubs. Some kind of scientist or doctor, maybe? Yeah, well, he ain't shit now. Did you find us a way in? Yeah, but the garage door's jammed. Can't raise it. Maybe if we use the remote on the garage door. Not a problem. Look what I found. A jack. I knew it. Oh yeah. That'll work. Oh shit. Zombie zombies. Yeah. Cool. Cool. Open sesame. Turn that shit! Turn crank! Oh my god. Oh my god, let's go. Let's go. Get... It's go time. You didn't even kill that fuck. He's gonna crawl in. He's a crawler. Take a look around. I'll make sure no stragglers get under this door. Uh, there's a battery in the truck. Battery? In the truck? Well, I can see where the battery should be, but it's not. Shit. Perfect. Uh... Let me buzz this down, beep boop beep. Hydraulic. Use the lift panel. No power. Buzzy badoobity. Looks like it's the hose for the lift hydraulics. Um, can we take the hose? Don't think I can pry that hose apart with just my hands. Maybe if I had something to cut it with. We could always use a hose. We could always use them hose. Um. Looters will be shot on sight. It's locked. No way in. Oh, the car light is blinking. Thank you. Well, how do we get in there, though? That's the thing. I can't reach it up there. Yeah, we need to bring it down. So, ho, ho. we need to use the remote on the car to bring it down. Here's some skizzes. Looks like Crawford had their own semi trucks. Skizzes, please. Skizzes, please. 
More of Crawford's rules. How did anybody live like this? I'd rather take my chances on the outside. Oh, don't alert the horde. <laughs> okay, can I look at this then? It's the panel that controls the hydraulic lift over there. Except it doesn't fucking work, does it? No power. Uh, how do I do this? Let me look at the car. That blinking must be an anti-theft system. Good chance of a working battery being in that car. If I can find a way to get up there. Climb on the truck, maybe. Can we climb over here? No? Okay, I'll just talk to Molly then. Something you need? Uh, can I borrow your hook? Think I can borrow that, uh, hook thing of yours? I, I don't know. Hilda and I have been through a lot together. Hilda? That's what I call her. Don't judge. Please, can I borrow Hilda? I'll take good care of her. She won't get a scratch. I got your promise now. Not a scratch. They should really be whispering to each other. Now, let's ice pick this thing. And then it'll let the hydrolo thing, hydraulic thing bob down. I did it. Whoa, oh, whoa. Shit. That's probably not good. No shit! Oh dear, get the battery before it alerts too many. I'll try to hold him off. Hurry! There's the battery. Finally something goes right. Oh dear, oh dear, unhook the battery, unhook the battery. Can I just take this off now? Still attached to the terminals. Shit, shit. Still shit. attached to the terminals. What the fuck? Still attached to the terminals. I'm not clicking on the terminals. Grab that. Got that fuck, one off! Man. That's what I'm trying to fucking click. It's off. Okay, grab it. Now drive this truck out of here. Got it. Yeah, but we still got a problem here. Put it in here, I'll carry it. Put it in the truck and drive back. Okay, follow me. Brilliant idea. Don't look through your crazy parkour. Shit. Move your ass! Oh, well, I'm moving it. I don't want my sweet ass to die. Shit, get up there, Lee. Don't trip over. Great, now what? Skylight. Uh, I'll boost you up. Oh, shoot it. It's shut. Shoot it out. Yeah, I was just trying to, but I accidentally scrolled off. Oh, shit. I'll, I'll boost you up, and then you lift me up. Or maybe the other way around. I'm tougher. Or you can ice pick up, and then I can, I can lift you up. Oh, dear. Oh, door. Hey, DJ Opic. Okay, so now we're Yes, you can die in this game. Do you ever stop complaining? Come on. You've got to work things out relatively quickly sometimes, and you got to, you know, not be a dumbass. Come I'll die on, what parts. are you, chicken? Jump! Okay. Chicken. What did you call me? I died twice, well, actually. You mention it. I think. By making the wrong choice and by being too slow, you can you can die. It's not necessarily talking choices, but yeah, Come choices on. of how to later. actually play the game. Something I gotta do first. What? Catch you later. Wait, you still got the battery? Yeah, I think I'll hold on to it. Make sure you don't leave without me. See you back in class. What if Finally. she gets murdered? God damn it! What the hell Takes is she the doing? Takes the battery to the grave. Okay, let's open the bloody locker. That can never be a bad idea. Can't open it without the combination. Does this guy n not know how to pick a lock? Hey, Uncle Vernon. You guys need any help? Thanks, but I think we're almost in. We're taking care of it, Lee. Don't worry. Okay, that's good. That's good. Good work, guys. Keep keep at it. Oh my god, something bad's gonna happen. I don't care about the. Pr oh, what's this photo? Must be the guy who ran this place. Looks like he figured himself as some kind of supreme leader. <laughs> when you die, you want to be buried with your battery. Egyptian style. 
Well, bunny Egyptian style. Dun, 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 dun. We're not going back out there. Uh, where was the... Was it this way? Oh, shit. Little help! Little help here! Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. The doors won't close on the way! Lee, do something! Holy shit. We got it! Break the door with something! Get the hatchet. Hatchet the door. Oh my god. That ain't gonna last long. Damn well better. There's so many of them. I need black blowflies rich enough for batteries. You got the fuel. Let's not start high-fiving each other just yet. Let's get the hell back to the classroom. Give us a hand with these fuel cans. They weigh a goddamn ton. Oh my god. Hey, how'd you guys make out? We got the fuel. Awesome. Good job, guys. We also did a whole How you doing with that door? Movies. Not so good. Here, let me give you a hand. Yeah, they should have used the hedger to chop off you one of these legs yet? and use that to hold the door closed. Yeah, Molly has it. Use she should leg. be back here soon. She'd better be. Um, so you guys still fooling around with that? We need to. We don't need flags. Well, we could use a flag, I suppose. Well, it's not very flags aren't very hardy, are they? Can we go? What's this way? Nope, nothing. Hmm. Empty. Oh, empty locker. Nothing in there. Sounds like there's a shit ton of walkers out there. <laughs> Does it really sound like that? Can we go into one of these? No, we don't want to go in there, obviously. We don't want to go back out there to- Wait! Actually, yeah, we do want to go back out here. Because they were behind another fence, so we can totally go out here. Not going back out there unless I have a damn good reason. Oh, man. Open the door and let the party in. What a genius I Shit. Kristen Vernon must be trapped in there. I don't want to shoot them. Okay. Well, let's shoot them. I didn't want to actually shoot them. Oof, they call me Dead Eye Black Man. Hey, man. What the hell happened? They wandered into the hallway after we got inside. I think they must have heard us rooting around in here. The whole place is infested. They're everywhere. Calm down. I took care of them. What about the meds? Did we find what we need? Yeah, that's our other problem. Take a look. Her Looks like they were code. keeping all the prescription meds in that safe. Locked up tight. Can we bust it open? There's no way we can bust it open? Maybe with enough time, but I don't know how much of that we have. Be a hell of a lot quicker if we just knew the four-digit combination. Well, I doubt they just wrote it down and left it here for us to find. We should just try busting it open. We don't have any other choice. Okay, you get started. I'll take a look around, see if I can find anything useful. It depends, Lum. I might do chapter 5. If I was up to like 30 viewers or something, yeah, I'd do chapter 5, but I'd have to whisper and boost my mic a bit. But, um, otherwise I'll do it tomorrow Some night. Kind of medical file. <laughs> Watch it be 1, 2, 3, 4. <laughs> Actually, we, we could try 1, 2, 3, 4. That's probably not what it is, though. Probably not what it is. Uh, there's probably some kind of clue around here. A sonogram? What's that? What's this on the floor? Baby? It's Pregnancy? A Use the remote. Actually, I've got the remote right here. Now, uh, we just uh, press the open button. I've got, yeah, real life, genuine, left, uh, 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 
Walking Dead remote right there. If only Doug were here, he could work it out. Uh, already cleaned out. We're not going to shoot it. He we, he said it would take a lot of time to open. I don't think shooting it will work. Y'all already checked these drawers? Yes, Lee. Nothing in there worth taking. What about this uh, camera? No tape inside. No tape. Where they keep the tapes. The tape. The camera can see the thingy. Look at the medical file. Looks like some kind of medical file. Actually, Ben killed everybody. Everybody that is and now a walker was killed by Ben. Guess she must have been a patient here. And what's this? A tape. He lost an neck. Oh wait, I already greeted you, didn't you? Didn't I? I don't know. I don't know. But welcome back, regardless, because you haven't chatted for a while. Oh shit, hit the mic. Vernon, Krista, come look at this. This is day 82 since the outbreak. 1547, Dr. Logan in consultation with patient Anna Correa. Why are you recording this? Regulations. Oberson has ordered me to keep records of all medical examinations and consultations. I need you to brace yourself, Anna. The sonogram confirms that you're pregnant. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Alright, looks like we're getting the coat hanger. As you know, the rules are very clear. The termination is mandatory. You don't have to tell them. Tell them it was just nausea. But you gave me something for it and it went away. This is my problem, not yours. If Oberson finds out that I concealed evidence of a pregnancy, I'm sorry, but these are the rules. I'm going to give you a sedative. It'll make the procedure oh, easier. What's the code? I don't want the procedure. I want my baby. I can't do this. I can't do this. Anna, you don't have a choice. Now, if you like, you can take some time with this. But I need you to come back no later than tomorrow. Or I'll have no choice but to inform Oberson myself. I'm sorry. Well, I can see where this is going. She killed them. They become walkers, and it all goes to hell. Damn it! We almost had it. What the hell kind of place was this? Like Molly said, the worst kind. Lee, maybe there's another tape. We gotta keep looking. I think I recognize that doctor. He was one of the walkers out in the alley by the auto shop. Maybe you should search it. See what he's got on him. Search the old guy in the alleyway. Righty ho. Her unborn baby killed them. She gave birth and then the baby was stillborn. And it was a stillborn zombie and it murdered everybody. And it infected them all and all that. That's what happened. That's actually what happened. You guys are spoiling it now. Try to kill that old man. I'm not going to try to kill the old man. The old man's all good. Maybe Molly was the patient. Oh, I don't think she looked like the patient. She was she was blonde and Molly was, the the patient was brown haired, wasn't she? Brunette. Oh dear. Oh dear. There's gonna be a zombie in here this time. I can tell. I'd be surprised it wasn't one of the or around this corner. There's gonna be zombies here. Some motherfucking zombies. Zombies! Zombies? Oh! oh my god, I knew it. I fucking knew it. Kill that fuck. Holy shit. <sighs> the, ch the child grew up and then killed that doctor. This is... The, the Walking Dead has actually been going on for like 16 years. Molly was the baby. It's... Brilliant, and it's all so obvious. Okay. Hey, dude. Sorry, but I'm gonna have to bash your brains in. If you don't mind, terribly. Oh, man. Now let's search the mongrel. Oh, God. Maybe Molly is actually Clementine's mother. This might be just what we need. And what's this? Looks like some kind of code. Oh, but Vernon said the safe combination was only four numbers. It's the code for the locker. 
Oh shit. Shit. Time to go. Time to go, man. Time to go. How did he get back? I don't know. We'll leave that small plot hole. We'll allow it. That one, because I didn't want the trouble of getting back anyway. Excuse me. Logan. Was this one? One of them said Logan on it, I think. Well, let's just try this one. Logan. Oh, yes, it is Logan. This must have been his locker. The crazy lady was obviously Klim's one. The safe combination has got to be on one of these. Okay. Shit, my bricks. You slash TP. <laughs> That's right. Hey, Kamasek, welcome back. And yet, I found two more tapes. Pyro, stop, stop getting you I all over. October 10th. That's the day after the first one we watched. Put it in. Have you made a decision? I thought you said I didn't have a choice. Well, technically, you do. You can terminate the pregnancy, or leave Crawford. Of course, that would be a death sentence for both you and your unborn child. Maybe that's best. I stayed up all last night thinking about this. Why are we even trying to survive, to keep on living, if this is what it takes? If this is what it's turned us into? I don't make the rules, Anna. Doctor, I'm begging you. Please, help me. Maybe one day, when things are different, you can try again. But for now, today, we have to do this. Oh, we got the... Oh, shit. That's how it happened. No. 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 Oh, dear. I don't think we know what happened to Crawford. More importantly, we got the combination. Was what? Krista, are you all right? What's wrong? It's nothing. That was just hard to watch. Don't worry about me. I'm fine. Did she right. have a miscarriage or something? Let's get those meds and get the hell out of here. Rest in hell. Yeah, indeed. We're in business. Antibiotics, morphine. We take as much of this as we can carry. Okay, I think we're good. This is more than enough for your people and mine. Let's go. You know, I found a third tape in the locker outside. Maybe there's something else on there. We got the meds for Omid. That's all I care about. We'll head back to the classroom. Don't take too long, Lee. The moon is actually the Earth's miscarry. The Earth miscarried and, and the moon came out. It was trying to give birth to another planet. Okay, enough talk about miscarriage, though. It's kind of grim. Let's watch the next tape. Pills here. There's a tape here. Oh my god. Oh Listen, my god. As long as this was, I have to put a stop to this little arrangement. This is the last I can give you. Why? Oberson had someone down here yesterday taking inventory. He's really cracking down. I just can't risk it. We had a deal. Yes, we had a deal. We don't anymore. My sister needs this medicine. Without it, she'll die, or she'll start showing symptoms, and they'll take her away. I can't let that happen. I'm sorry, Molly. I've done all I can, but I have to look out for myself here. Yeah, that's the Crawford way, isn't it? Well, shit. I hope that's a joke, Kamasek. Because the entire point of feminism is for women who are currently, in most places in the world, disadvantaged to get equal rights, not to get superiority. Hey, Nefisma. Oh God. Jesus Christ! Oh, you scared the shit out of me. Where the fuck have you been? Sightseeing. I'll take that battery now. Oh, yeah. Uh, 
about that. What happened to it? Oh, you still got it. You're joking. You're joking. I'm just kidding. Oh. Here you go. What's that? Nothing. Uh, I know you're from Crawford. You can quit with the act, Molly. I know you're from Crawford. What? Who told you that? I saw you on a security tape. Why'd you lie to me? I said there were stories about Crawford. I never said that's how I knew about it. I never lied to you, and even if I did, so what? I don't owe you anything. You that's saved my life twice, but you can't tell me the truth? Are we really gonna do this now? I guess that's up to you. I used to live here with my sister. She was 14 years old. When the dead started walking and Crawford shut itself in, it seemed like a pretty good deal at first. We were safe. We had everything we needed to survive. Then the rules started coming down. No one who couldn't justify their place or in their keep. No one who required special care. My sister was diabetic, and by Crawford's rules, that made her a liability. I kept it a secret. I kept her safe for as long as I could, but in the end, I couldn't protect her. That's when Shit. I got out. Crawford, they always talked about how their system worked. How anything was better than becoming one of them. But I saw what they'd already become. I just wish I could have seen it before it was too late. Before they came and took my sister away. Yeah, I reached 27 last night when I was playing Walking Dead. This is all I have left of her. I didn't have time to take it before I got out of Crawford. I just wanted it, okay? It's okay, Molly. I understand. She's pretty. What the hell? I think that's our cue to get the hell out of here. <laughs> okay, I'm sick. Yeah, I will definitely do the next, the last chapter if I reach 30. I might do it even if I don't reach 30. We'll see. Oh, Jesus! Holy crap. Sorry, sorry. I just got spooked by those bells, and then I heard someone coming. What the fuck are you doing out here? Kenny and I still can't get the door open to the armory. He sent me out to look for something we can use to bust it open. I found this. Oh shit, you fuck! Ben? Where did you get that? I just found it. It was stuck in the door handle at the end of the hallway. Oh no, no. Oh no. You shit. dumb cunt. Holy shit. This is not good. Holy shit, she's still hiding. Oh my god. Shoot this oh shit, did I just hit her? Fuck shit. Oh my god, no Molly! Oh my god, I'm so bad at this game. Holy shit. I'm sorry, Molly. It's very hard to shoot. No, 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 no. She can't die. She can't die. She's invincible. She's Molly. No, fuck. Fuck, I'm so bad. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. We can't leave Molly. Shit, she's got the battery, dude. What the fuck is going on? They're coming. Oh, shit. That ought to hold them. Sir, but now how do we get out? Through the armory. We can just get this damn door open. Come on, damn you! Where's Molly? I don't think she made it. Shit, man. She totally made it. Don't worry, she's Spider-Man in a way around. Oh, my fault. What the hell's he babbling about? Ben, we talked about this. No, wait. I want to know what he meant. What do you mean, this is all your fault? Kenny, I'm so sorry. No, I'm so no, sorry, no. fuck. Kid, this ain't the best time. Whatever you did, save it for later. Ben. Shut the fuck up! Fuck you, Lee! I can't do you this anymore! I hate me all along, putting all of us in danger! Katja and Doug, it was all me. It was all me. Wait a minute. What are you saying? It was me who made the deal with the bandits at the Motor Inn, slipping them supplies. I thought maybe I could keep them off our backs. When it got discovered, that's when they attacked. And that's when Doug... This is freaking bad, man. Kick his ass, lady. Man, I agree with you. You should kick his ass. But now's not the time. 
Gotta focus on getting out of here! You little kicks ass by not losing them on the fucking dead, you hear me? Dad! My wife and child! You gotta both fucking kill! Kenny, listen to me. You can whip his skinny little ass later, but right now we gotta go! If this asshole thinks he's getting on my boat after what he did, he's out of his motherfucking mind! You hear me, shitbird? You can stay behind and fucking rot! Kenny, we'll sort this out later. After we get out of here, okay? Ain't nothing to sort out. I just told you the way it's gonna be. The boat's not big enough for all of us. Somebody's gotta get left behind. Might as well be this piece of shit right here! Well, I vote we leave him. I'm sorry, Ben. I know you mean well. But all I want to do is get back to Omid, and you put that at risk. Mm -hmm. Ben's fucking useless, but I've seen enough of Crawford to know that becoming like them is the beginning of the end. You can't just abandon I vote people. Ben stays with us. What about the rest of us? Don't we get a second? Shit. Get the hell out of here. So much for the armory. What's left of it? Shit, man, let's just get the I'll freak out rounds. of here. That's it. You didn't close that door behind us? I could. The lock was busted. Great. Just fucking great. Come on. There's gotta be a way out down here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Fuck! That's not gonna hold. Back upstairs! Lee, look! Oh my god, can I please backpedal? All shooting these guys. Oh my god. 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 Pull your leg out, Lee. Pull your fucking leg out, Lee. Holy shit! No! Shit. Well, there you go. That's your proof that you can die. Shit, man. Alright, pull the leg out. Pull the leg free. Look up, look up, look up, look up, look up. Oh shit. What my fuck? Again. Alright, this time we're gonna do it successfully. God damn it. Pull the leg free twice. Two pulls and then we can look up. Shoot him in the head. Get the leg free. Oh my god, look up, look up, look up! Fuck! Shit, man! I died again! Okay, this time. Just pull the leg free once, then we have plenty of time. Look up. Shoot that motherfucker. Shoot that motherfucker. And now look down, pull the leg free. Look up, look up, look up, look up, look up. Whoops. Okay, look down, look down, look down, look down, get your leg. Oh shit. I hate it. Shit. Oh my god. Thank you. It's go time. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. No more hatchet. God. Come on! Any way out of here? This leads to the roof. We might be able to find a way down from there. You didn't come into town from the railroad, did you? Yeah. Why? Never mind. I can Zombies see the sewer where we came in from here. I think we can do this. Well, what are we waiting for? Go! Go! Yeah, we lost the hatchet. <laughs> Oh, 
champion. Come on, let's go! Come on, Ben, it's go time. Oh my god. Holy shit. Hold on, Ben! I've got you! Oh my god. Ben, climb up! Come on, you can do it! There's no time! You have to go! Now! Quit fucking around, Ben! Come on! Let go, damn it! Get the others out of here! We. Oui. Oh, shit. Lee, we both know. Let me go. We have to pull him up, man. We can't just let him die. Fuck that. Come on, man. Go, go, go. I'm not gonna fucking drop him. Shit. Even if he's useless and a dickhead. Omid? Clementine! Shit. Holy shit. Clementine! You made it back! Told you I would, didn't I? Did you find my parents? No. No, we didn't. Sorry, sweet pea. I looked for them, but no. Clementine, what happened here? When one of those things got inside, it tried to get upstairs. I stopped it. Upstairs? Homeed! You did good, kiddo. Real good. Where's Molly? She, uh, she didn't make it, Clem. I'm sorry. I liked her. Hey, what do you say we go check on Omid? She had the battery. Yeah, I accidentally shot Molly in the shoulder. <laughs> Shit. Krista? Everything okay? Omid! Oh, Omid's oh, dead. Oh, no. Krista, don't! Stay back! I never should have left you. I'm so sorry. Oh dear. Krista, get away from him. Oh dear. Oh, he's alive. Uh, <laughs> hey. Oh. Back already? Oh man. We what a got trickster. you medicine. Good. Feel like I could use some. You okay, kid? You look worse than I do. We almost didn't make it out of there because of this asshole. Should have left him behind, but we had the chance. Guys, what the hell happened out there? Let someone else tell you. I got work to do. We don't. We're not going to leave Ben okay, behind. Okay. With at a the little end. luck, you should start feeling better pretty soon. Because he'd die for sure. I'll stay here for a few more hours to check on him. Let me know if you need anything. Thanks, Doc. Yes, thank you so much. I mean, for sure, we're not taking Ben on the boat. Maybe but... now's a good time for you and me to have a little talk in private. This guy must have had throat cancer by the sound of his voice. Sorry about Bree. About what happened to Bree. Don't beat yourself up over it. It was nothing you could have done. You want to know the worst part? What? I don't feel much. I mean, I don't feel enough. Shouldn't I be broken up over what happened to her? That's how I was when I lost my daughter. When I lost my friends in those first few weeks. But now... It's like I just take something like this in stride. Like this is what our world is now, and we'd better just get used to it. What did you want to talk to me about? I know you care about Clementine. Anyone can see that. And I know you want what's best for her. But this plan of yours, putting everyone on a boat with no destination, do you really think that's her best chance of finding somewhere where she can be safe? Because I don't. So I want to make you an offer. What kind of an offer? 
I'll take her off your hands, take her back with me to my people. We're well supplied, well hidden, and a lot of us have had kids of our own. And now Crawford's fallen, we got nothing left to fear from them. She'll be safe with us. Safer than she will be if she stays with you, I promise you. That's what you want for her, isn't it? To be safe? I'm gonna pretend you didn't say any of this and give you a chance to walk away. Which you ought to do right now. I know you think you're doing what's best for her. And if you were her real father, we wouldn't be having this conversation. But you're not. And staying with you is not what's best for her. If no one else around here will tell you that, then I will. That little girl's in my care. We've been through more together than you can imagine. Anyone who tries to get between me and her, anyone, is gonna wind up dead. You hear me? Take your hands off me. Sweet pea. Kenny's working on the boat. I know. What are we going to do after he fixes it? Where will we go? Someplace else. Someplace else. Someplace better. Clem, honey, what's wrong? Is Ben going to be okay? He doesn't seem the same since he got back. Good night, Kemisic. Thanks for watching. Hmm. He feels Ben's guilty. a good kid. I think he's just feeling guilty about some of the decisions he's made. It's getting to feeling like he's a burden on the rest of us. Before we leave tomorrow, will we have time to look for my parents? Oh yeah, Molly over a battery. Um, there may not be time. I'd like to, Clem, but I don't think we'll have time. We really shouldn't stay here any longer. It's not safe. Clementine, your parents are dead. <laughs> Clementine? Oh shit. Clementine? McFlutie, they left her with a babysitter. They just went on holiday. Like, plenty of normal parents do that. Where is everybody? Clementine? Clementine! Oh, oh shit. And again, he just strides over. No, they left it before the apocalypse started, McFlutie. Oh shit. Grim? Oh dear. This is gonna be a zombie! Oh my. Oh jeez. Oh dear. Oh shit! Oh, no, 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 oh, fuck. Lee? 
Lee? You out here? Lee! Oh shit. Are you crazy? What are you doing out here? It ain't safe. Lee? Hey guys. Where's Clementine? I got bitten. She's not in her room. Vernon ain't in the house either. Oh. What the hell is going on? Whose blood is that? It's mine. Oh my god. No way. No. No fucking way. There's no time to worry about me. Clementine's gone. There's no chance she just wandered off on her own? No. No way. Then who the hell took her? I don't know. Last night Vernon came to me and offered to take her with him. Said she'd be better off. Son of a bitch. I knew we couldn't trust that fucker. Wherever she is, I have to find her. Okay. What do you need from us? Clint may not have much time. We have a better chance of finding her if we all go together. Who's with me? We're all responsible for Clementine. And in your condition, you may not make it to her in time. She needs our help. All of our help. Mm -hmm. Damn right. We can't let you do this alone. So that's settled then. We'll look for Clementine together. Thanks, yep. you guys. I appreciate it. Really. Lee, man, you know I care about Clementine, and I am a Christian man, and I keep asking myself, if this was me, asking you for help, asking you to put your life on the line, would you be there for me? What the fuck? There's been fuck? plenty of times when you ain't been. Of course I fucking would. Kitty man, I'm begging you here. I can't do this alone. I need your help, please. You might not have been keeping score, Lee, but I have. And you've been looking out for yourself more often than your friends. Shit, Well, man. maybe that's a good thing. Because you're on your own on this one. What about you, Ben? I don't know. Whatever you think is best. Well, Ben, you're useless, but uh, Clementine's gonna need you, maybe. Clementine's one of the few good things left in this world. She always had a kind word for you, Ben. But she needs you now. Don't you think you owe it to her to help? You're right. I owe her. I swear, before this is all over, I'm gonna show you I can do something right. I'll prove it to you. You'll see. Good man. Okay, guys. We should go find Vernon. See if he took her. Let's head out. I'll get the boat out onto the river. Figure I can wait there until you get back. Or at least until nightfall. You're still gonna take me. Even Ben. Yeah, we'll figure out what to do about that when the time comes. Come on, guys, let's go. Okay, see you now for smart. Oh shit. They ditched. Where the hell are they? Looks like they got out of here in a hurry. Vernon! Get out here! There doesn't have to be any trouble here. All I want is the girl. Give her back and nobody needs to get hurt. Did I kill Larry? That depends who's Larry. <laughs> oh, the old guy. I didn't kill him. Because there's wind in the sewers. I guess. Smelly winds. Yeah, you can play it through the game again. Oh, you ask him, Dick. I see.
Oh shit. Clementine, are, are you alright? Where are you? Vernon, you son of a bitch! Where have you taken her? This is Vernon. And you should really watch your tone. Clementine's fine. But if I were you, I'd choose my next words very carefully. Okay, killed the boy in the attic, of course. We were rational and honest to Vernon. Most people took her to the frickin' Crawford. Most people pulled him up. And most people showed the bite. Wow, what a frickin' cliffhanger. Holy shit. Well, I was second highest percentage, I guess. Most people, wait, most people just get Kenny, and the rest ditch? What the shit? Opinions on M4? I don't, know, I don't really. Can't really form a concise thought about it at the moment. Um. Sorry guys. We're only on 14 viewers, so I'm, <laughs> I'm gonna uh, call it a night for streaming to now. I, I do actually want to continue streaming, continue playing this game. But if I continue streaming past this point, I'd have to be whispering like this. I'd have to be whispering like this. And then have my, my mic boosted and all that stupid shit like I was last night. So we're going to leave it tonight. But I'm going to do it same same time tomorrow night. I'm going to do it at 8 o'clock tomorrow night. Okay? So just so you guys know, it's like 10.15 right now. So call it 10 o'clock. I'm going to do it in 22 hours. In 22 hours, okay? So this time tomorrow, minus two hours, I'm going to be doing the last chapter of The Walking Dead. So I know a lot of you guys want to come back and watch that, obviously, and I'm glad to do. Um, so I'm going to do that same time tomorrow night, okay, in 22 hours, we'll do The Walking Dead, episode five.